Welcome. So what I'd like to do is show you how to evaluate for the cosecant of arctan of x divided by the square root of 2. So to do a problem like this, what we're going to do is, you know, we notice that obviously we don't have a point on the unit circle. We're going to have to create a triangle. So to find the inverse tangent, remember this says tangent of an angle is equal. So tangent of an angle is equal to x over the square root of 2. And I need to figure out what is that angle. So remember, tangent of an angle is equal to your opposite over adjacent. So I can create two triangles. I have a triangle here, which would be opposite over my adjacent. Or I could also create another triangle, which would be my opposite, negative opposite over negative adjacent. Since they're both negative, they'd make a positive, where here's my theta and here's this theta. But remember, since we're dealing with the arc tangent, that my triangle has to triangle has to fall within the first or the um, fourth quadrant. And you can notice that this triangle is not going to be, cannot be created with a theta that's within the range for the tangent function. So therefore, here's my triangle that I need to use. And so I have theta, opposite is x, adjacent is square root of 2. I need to be able to figure out my hypotenuse. So by using Pythagorean theorem, we say a squared plus b squared equals c squared. Or the leg squared plus the leg squared equals your hypotenuse squared. Well, here's my two legs. So I can say x squared plus the square root of 2 squared equals my hypotenuse squared. So therefore, I have x squared plus 2 equals my hypotenuse squared. Now to undo my hypotenuse squared, I'll take the square root of both sides. So I have the square root of x squared plus 2 equals my hypotenuse. Therefore, my hypotenuse is going to be x squared plus 2, or I'm sorry, the square root of x squared plus 2. Now I need to determine what is the cosecant. So the cosecant, remember, of theta is going to equal your hypotenuse over your opposite. So therefore, in this problem, you can see that my um, hypotenuse is square root of x squared plus 2, and my opposite side is x. So therefore, by evaluating this function, I have the square root of x squared plus 2 divided by x. There you go, ladies and gentlemen. Hope you enjoyed. Thanks.